There is a big difference between Tuareg children who go or do not go to school. The Tuareg who have gone to school no longer have slaves and rarely act violently. The rebellion made access to school very difficult. Some parents were afraid of bringing their children to school, and others thought that we wanted to influence them against their traditions. These children you see here are the engineers and employees of the future, regardless whether they are Tuareg, Hausa or Peul people. Classes are given in French and Tamashek, which is the language spoken by the Tuareg. We try to teach them a basis of general knowledge without forgetting those aspects of tradition that we consider essential. Anyway, either using this or any other learning procedure, there is always something more important than the teaching system, to live in peace. The schooling of their children is one of the key factors to persuade the Tuareg people to abandon the nomadic life and to integrate themselves in the modern world. This type of school started at the time of the French colonization. The continuous exodus motivated by the severe drought suffered in 1973 and 1984, together with 10 years of war, have not allowed them to develop the educational system in a regular way. Little by little, parents finally understood that an education meant an advantage to find jobs apart from those of the nomadic breeding of animals, and that consequently, it would also mean an open door to future prospects for their children in a time of crisis such as this. 